What up, though, heist man? The foe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. What's done in the dark always come to the light. First of all, I want to say respect the dead. You know, I got to show um, respect to the dead. This ain't my story, though, so don't be mad at me. But Takashi 6 9 he back making music again. And he going on his little press run. And he went and did DJ Academic show along with Hassan Camel and Wack 100. And I know what y'all going to say, man. Here we go again. Same old shit, dog. Just a different day. I, I mean, that's what I'm saying, man, because I don't want to see no 40 year old gangsters talking about trying to out thug each other, out gangster each other. But it seemed to happen, man. People love listening to stuff like that. But Hassan Camel, he came out, you know, after the, um, the show was over with. And he had to um, play some audio that he played about um, Nipsey Hussle from this man behind him, Wack 100. And the audio was saying that um, Nipsey Hussle was out here, you know. Gay banging, gang banging, or however you want to call it, man. They say he out here in them streets, man. That's what he, that's what he said. The audio. I mean, that's what I heard from the audio. Um, it's kind of wild, man. Like the audio was saying that, like basically, from Wack One Hundred, the um, my man right here, Hassan Campbell, he played. He was saying that, yo, Nipsey Hussle in these streets, man. They say, look, he paying people. To be with his wife, you know, to have relations with his wife. And he said he, like, he basically protected that man his whole career from that secret coming out. I'm saying, bro, you got to relax, man. The West Coast, they love Nip, man. Like, they love Nipsey Hussle. And you out there saying that stuff about him? Like, I don't know, man. First of all, they ain't going to want to find out that their favorite rapper gay or or Nipsey was gay. If this, I'm saying this is all allegedly, man. Like, they don't want to find out that he a fake gangster and all this stuff, man. So, I don't know. I don't know what to say about this, man. Like I said, I don't know if it's true. That's what I'm saying. Well, Hassan, played the, um, Hassan Campbell played the audio, and it was with Wack 100 saying this stuff about Nipsey. And this some West Coast stuff. This above my pay grade. And um, I was like, be careful out there, bro, because, hey, it's going to be some retaliation. Because people, um, they love Nip, man. R.I.P. to Nip. But, um... You come up, you exposing people or outing people. I don't know. I don't know. Like I said, I don't know if they want to. If it's true, I don't know if they want to know that um, they favorite gangster and out here. But yo, big shout out to them, man. If that's his truth, man. Yo, I mean, he ain't even here to defend himself, man. So that that's kind of crazy. That's why people like. That's why I'm like, yo, come on, bro. You don't do that, man, like that when he not here. I mean, it was an old conversation, but you going around spreading that rumor. First of all, if it's a rumor, I don't know. That's that man business, man. Let him do his thing, man. But, yo, y'all got to go check it out, man. It's going to be everywhere. I mean, it, it is everywhere. You go look it up. Hassan Campbell, he got the um, audio of it. Of Wack 100 saying Nipsey Hussle was gay out here in these streets, man. And mm -mm. We definitely going to be talking about this Friday right here on this channel. Because I go live every Friday talking about stuff just like this. You just got to come through and holler at me, man. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you got to hit to get this pimping that I'm putting out when I put it out. And like I said, I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. right here on this channel, man. Come through and holler at your boy. Heist Man the Foe. Talk that talk. Ghetto news and opinions. Peace.